12.22a time. Low budget because I'm busy with a billion other projects. Confused? Read this. Now it's common practice for me to show group photos of each meetup, and I didn't really do that last time so here we go. I also found Max and Henry's YouTube channel so go watch their videos at the link in the description. Next, we've got a nice paper cutout style twow intro by Object Show Fan 54 aka DumDum54. Hi, I'm Kim, and welcome to Child 22 a Starring just the power of the polarizer, Mr. Twister as the two-time zombie, Midnight Light as the Scandal Survivor, the Mighty Midge, the leader of the pun resistance, and his friend Sam Billinge. Oh yeah, it's supposed to be in his hand. And yes, Sewin, the board game expert. Welcome to 1222A. And here's another shorter intro by McOddsin. <laughs> Recently, SpicyMan33 was concerned that former Power Twower Jumma Talk was collaborating with Midnight Light, or worse, writing her responses for her. I suppose this isn't technically against the rules, but it is frowned upon. If Midnight's Twow 21 responses were different, Spicy may have survived. So, I set up a poll to see if SpicyMan33 should be brought back and if Midnight Light should be punished. Unfortunately, the poll was confusing, was hacked from both sides, and stirred up a lot of twama on H1 Central. As a result, in the end we all decided it would be the most fair to all the previously eliminated Twowers if Spicy stayed eliminated too. Goodbye a second time, Spicy. But does Midnight Light get to keep her triple response prize? Well, following my precedent of sticking to my word with even poorly designed prizes, I'm gonna say yes. What will happen to prizes in Twow 22 and beyond? I haven't decided yet. Oh hey, I've got mail! 14th best Twower, Sumner the Pie Guy, has yet another wonderful Twow statistic report, and it looks like Sushi, LP Carver, Lauren Teasel, Imagine 4, who actually is Tau Girl, and Hurry Churi were all desperate enough for mentions to join in. Hello everybody, Sushi here. Hey guys, it's LP Carver. I'm Lauren Teasel. I'm Imagine 4. And I'm Hurry Churi. And we'll be giving you an update on various spreadsheet and statistics news. After Trial 21A, Ping Pong Cup Shots tied Spicy at 92 mentions, and was more relevant due to being mentioned in more episodes. However, after 21B, Spicy has surpassed PPCS and is now the first flower to have over 100 mentions. Due to recent problems with lag, SNTPG has split the spreadsheet into two files, the original containing the most important data, while the others have miscellaneous sheets such as the guestbook. Go check it out. As of now, the Twow Comparatrol is broken. Sunder the Pie Guy is attempting to revamp it, so stay tuned. That's all for now. Enjoy, Enjoy the episode. Also join the Discord Game Show Hub. Fine, link to Discord Game Show Hub is in the description. And by the way, it has scientifically been proven to be impossible to enjoy this crappy episode. So I don't know what these five are going on about with this ENJOY THE EPISODE. You can try, but you can't succeed. So you know, we're at Twow's final five, yay. Time to rush through confessionals. Nothing from Joho. Mr. Twister had this confessional whose absurd length MAKES ME SO MAD I WANT TO- Never mind. Anyway, here's Meester's confessional, but every time he says a Twower's name, it gets faster. I was SpicyMan33's sidekick way back in Twow 6B, and now he is tragically gone. We were the last living sidekick team. Meester Twister has the letters MT for initials, and M is the 13th letter of the alphabet, while T is the 20th, and 13 plus 20 equals 33, wow. But what's the only vowel in Meester Twister? It's and E, which upside down is the number 3. And Meester has 3 E's, while Twister has 3 E's. We were truly a great match of great coincidences, but that ship has sailed now. Goodbye, HTC server owner and friend. In case you were wondering why I changed my book to Joseph Howard's design, I was testing a hypothesis that having Joho's design gave you some sort of prize-winning advantage. Just maybe, Joho's book design is a lot of professionals with a lot of optimal way to play Twow, since you won't be trained in a row. But ironically, neither Joho's book design, a different hypothesis of creating one, that keeps you in a Twow's book design, I can't create any 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 Twow's book design, I can't create any
excuse me. So what Meester was talking about was this lovely five-way combo book drawing for me to use as his book. However, creating a high-quality book image based off of this drawing would take a lot of time, so I went for a more spray-painted look. Besides, this adds a variety, and variety is nice, right? Midnight Light didn't have a book change, but she did have a fitting five-word confessional. Woo, final five. Grats, everyone. Very succinct, Midnight, but the record for conciseness still belongs to Tak Ajnan. Fourth up is the mighty Midge, who zipped his lips before his tongue could slip. Midge was going to hold Spicy's sprayer in his other hand, but decided against it. So if Midge isn't going to commemorate Spicy's elimination, who will? Well, just like always, Yasoin's got us covered with a flashy new book that has a spicy flair. This was his confessional. Final 5 is tense, but I hope the audience enjoys these final rounds of highly intellectual combat. On guard, also made it to my birthday, score! But you can see from the initials that Yasoin is trying to show off what he got for Christmas. Subtle. We're done, so as you know, it's the final five who submitted a total of 11 entries to the 22nd trial prompt, which was, compare Atlantis and Dream Island using alliteration on at least five words. Twowers will be ranked by their highest performing response, and the Twower with the worst score will be eliminated next episode. But most importantly, viewers of this video, vote! You can vote up until January 7, 2017 at 10 p.m. UTC. Remember, you viewers can vote whether you're a contestant or not by commenting on this video. So how do you vote? Pause the video at a random spot in the green rectangle. Type the keyword you see in the upper right, space. Rank the entries from best to worst using these letters. Surround it with square brackets. Done. You can comment other stuff too, and you can vote more than once. It turns out that all 11 entries had exactly 10 words, so I don't need to show you the word count. Instead, I'm going to show you the size of each alliterated chunk of words. I chose to classify alliteration as either phonetic or spelling-wise, whichever helped out the response the most. Alliterated chunks are also color-coded, so that's all you gotta know. Here are the voting images. That's it for Twow 22A. Now, I gotta look at all your guys' amazing Twow fan art, including this updated Twow periodic table by Milo Jacquet. So, see you there!